Hey everybody, this is MG Vids back with some more Plunder Knots. I'm going to take another run of the boss here. Um, I haven't gotten my other torpedo armor yet. It's actually still in the forge. But I got a really good tip um, off of some of the YouTube comments saying, hey, go ahead and run instead once you throw on a shield. So I forged a shield uh, and got this 1620 shield strength, the shield of nano regen. So. The damage ideal is converted to health, so it's actually a pretty good shield. And so I'm going to also drop on the uh, torpedo armor. Now let's go back in and see if we can knock this guy out. The last boss here, and go over to the, off to the next system. Uh, just one thing I wanted to point out. So this planet here, Hartley, somebody was asking me, hey, how did you get through that? Um, so when you played initially, you know, there are basically these three laser fields with all of the crates in between them and the laser fields do an enormous amount of damage, right? So I would use my crew member to boost through that field, grab all of the items, and then when I come out on the other side, I would uh, go ahead and sit there with my regen tech mod, build my life all the way back up, and then go to the next one. So it took forever, but that's how I worked through uh, that level. Now this guy's so fast is the only thing is that he just like outruns all my torpedoes, which do some significant damage. But hopefully we should be able to lay this guy out. Because now we cut down his torpedo armor, his torpedoes to seven hundred. And then we have the shield as well. So if this doesn't work out, then we'll cast the next episode once I've got uh my tor torpedo armor finishes forging. Uh, I wanted to get out of the way before that torpedo got to me. Throw up the shield. doing some significant damage to me here. Again, part of it is just like, I have a slow ship, you know? But if we can get him here just a little bit longer... Ah, man, we almost got him too, and he just knocked out my shield with his torpedo. All he's doing is just flying circles around me. So my beam... I have so many, uh... Oh, gosh, man. He just almost had... What I'm thinking is I save my crew member when my shield is down, boost, run away from those torpedoes, and then throw it back up. I had so many rocket attacks just missing the guy. That's pretty, uh... We almost had him. I think we can... I think we can get him with... with the shields. It's just... The problem is, like, really my issue is so many of my attacks are missing him. And so, maybe I need to wait till he... Because he does close and stop, right? So when he closes and stop, maybe that's where I'll try to get off most of the hits at. Because I can deal a lot of damage. Alright, let's go. This thing takes so long sometimes. And really, it's going to be better for me to throw on my, uh, there. Now I'll throw on my... I'm going to throw this on once I had, well, my shield on once I had, uh, taken some damage. Because... Jeez, man. Alright. Trying to get the regen out of this. I right, got the shield up. I just cannot land these torpedo hits on him. He's got no problem landing them on me. Look, they're just like floating there. <laughs> Alright. Got his health low. We're in a little bit better shape than we were. Hit that shield up. 
I think I just missed it because I it didn't go down when his torpedo hit me. All right, man. He's got the same issue as me though, charging torpedoes. You know, it takes time. So you can see, like, he'll close the, the distance. Ah, there we go. He'll close the distance, drop a torpedo, and then run away. So that was definitely a rough little battle. <laughs> but look at all the plunder we're getting out of this. 10,000 gold, 1,500 XP, and all kinds of stuff. What is this? Huh, I haven't gotten one of those before. What the heck? An epic bomber. That's pretty sweet. Too bad I'm not running bombers right now. But that's a lot of cash. Legendary laser turret. That's really good. Holy crap. Okay, so we need to, we need to slap that on here. So let's slap on this le the legendary laser. And then uh, dive into the next system here. That's pretty freaking good. Collect our bounties for some more antimatter. So 271 damage with that laser. I'm going to drop that, I think, right on the front and move this missile turret to the other side. No, keep that torpedo there. Put that where that laser is because this laser does 153. So we'll get rid of that beam turret. Oh, wait, did I just put a torpedo back there? That's 161, 139. Alright, I'm going to put this laser right on the front here. Along with the torpedo. Alright, perfect. So we're running a legendary laser right up front. Man, this thing just deals some sick damage. Awesome. Alright, let's go back to Galaxy, take a look at what this next system looks like. Collect a thousand. And shoot on through to the Polaris system. High density of wormholes. Heavily traveled, huh? Okay. The Los Banditos. <laughs> Awesome. Let's take a f look at this first planet here. I'm fighting around like a crystalline structure. Alright, let's go ahead and just lay waste to this guy with his laser. Throw up the shield. Some really good damage here. Each, so each of those bursts is doing several hundred. And then you follow that up with the torpedo right from behind. That's great. I'm still waiting. My, uh... Tank. My latest uh, laser, or I'm sorry, shit, the ship that I have in the forge is still cranking through. So that won't be done until like later today. I think late tonight, actually. So once that comes out, that ship should come out at hopefully level 11, since I've leveled up. Which would then let me, um, you know, start leapfrogging ships, sh right? So then I can then I can slap all this gear onto the level 11 ship, take this ship, and throw it back in the forge as I start closing in on level 12. That way, I'm constantly grinding a higher level ship, but I have a ship to play with, right? All right, so two battle cruisers here. Fire a really slow torpedo. Actually, with this laser, what I should put on is like a laser amp. throw up the shield right as I get to him, get the regen going. Now let's turn around and go grab this other guy. So having a shield that also does, you know, converts damage is great. The one, my one frustration with this ship is just how ridiculously slow it is. <laughs> just meandering. Alright, shield is up right in time. Close and destroy. Awesome. That laser torpedo combo is nasty when I can actually land the torpedoes. 
and getting some really good XP out of this too. Alright, take that. Look at that plunder, man. 916, that's good. I'm still waiting to see when I get another one of these um, the robots pop up in the store. I haven't seen one again. But now it's going to be harder to do, I think, because ship upgrades are going to cost so much. I got a feeling going to 12 is going to run me something like, you know, 100,000. Alright, let's start trying to make our way over to here. He was just, like, trapped in here all by himself. Alright, hold on. Now let's back all the way out. There we go. Dropping the lasers and missiles. And now close with the torpedo. It's just a lethal combo. I mean, that's like three golds in a row. I haven't had a streak like that before. I'll typically take some damage. But I think it's also having that shield combo in there. And I'm even running torpedo armor right now, and no one I've faced has, ha has torpedo. So, MG vids with some more Plunder Knots playthrough. We're now in the Polaris system, grinding our way through. Um, and we'll bring you another video here shortly, uh, showing our progress. It looks like... Let's see how big this system is. Looks like we're going around the star... Okay, yeah, so this is going to be a long one. Awesome. Alright, so hey, uh, we'll see you in our next video. Um, and if you haven't already, we'd encourage you to subscribe to the channel to keep taking a look at all the content we're bringing to YouTube, and we'll see you soon. Uh, let us know kind of where you're at in the game, um, maybe some of the tips or tactics that you're using that are, you're finding helpful as well in the comments.